Sorry, do. Hey, film it. It's only got five minutes, mate. I'm running late. I've got to hit balls. I've got to part. Hey, 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 calm down. Hey, calm down. Come back here. What do you mean? <laughs> what are you worried about? You've got five I've minutes. I've got five minutes. It's what? not enough time for me to get ready. It's heaps of time. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to can hitting balls, right? Forget that. You don't need to do that. Some of the greats didn't do that. Colum on Gobbery. Never. Right? Before a round. <laughs> hit balls other times. But you don't need to. You need to do two things that, that most PGA Tour players did, right? And it requires you to lie on the ground number one. No balls needed. Oh, my stress level's coming down. <laughs> exactly right. Come on the ground, come on. All right. <laughs> Look like you're zen down already. Okay, so this is not, a, not about stretching, believe it or not, right? Right. This is about finding a consistent range of motion. So, right. so drop that leg to start with. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Get your shoulders back on the ground. Yeah. Yeah, happy days. Yeah. So, this is your first time doing it, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna go easy. But if I push the old leg and start stretching the glute to the lower back, I'll reach a flex point. Yeah, probably about there. Yeah. <laughs> right. And because I haven't tested you, I don't know where that is. But all tour players do a range of motion test and they know their disassociation ability between their up and lower. Right. Some try to get it higher than 65%, but 65 is pretty much the break even. Um, that was 90. What? Percent. <laughs> <laughs> Danny Willett. Here's an example. Yeah. He can only get it very minimal um, distance. So he's had to change his swing. He can't get it to 65, but that's basically where we go, and some players can go more. Right. So I would stretch you to a range that is similar to where you normally get. Yeah. Okay, now if oh, you can yeah. get there easy, you jump straight up. Oh. But if you can't, <laughs> you've got to get that disassociation. I'm yeah. going to stretch the envelope here yeah. to a level oh. where you're back to your consistent range. And that's number one. Yeah. You're getting the Ferrari, or yeah. I don't know what you call this. Yeah, yeah. Cadillac. <laughs> Cadillac. You're getting the Cadillac to the same position to drive every day, rather right. than jumping in a Mini Miner and then jumping in a Ferrari yeah. another day. That makes it so much yeah. good now. You're good. Right, so jump up. That is, is that stage nice? one. Right. Now we putt. Let's, yeah. we've only, now we've got three minutes. Well, that's enough. All right, so grab your putter. All right, come on in tight, Phil. All right, and we are putting from a foot to two feet. So put your little ball there. Well, right. and what, we can put a foot there. <laughs> the big foot There's from you. There's a foot. But look, just tap it in. Start tapping, all right? So make the most of your time. So here's the deal, right? Putting from this distance, they do another one. Right? Most people, their number one fault is they do not align their putter face to their target, right? It's a worldwide problem. But from a foot or so, it's pretty obvious to get your you know, putter face pointing to your target. It doesn't really, you know, get that offline, right? So that's the first part of the warm-up, yep. is putter face to your hole. Once that's, you know, done, you can do that for a few more putts if you want, but just move out now to five or six feet, so a little further out, that's it. Now, you're close enough to get the let's call it the hole or the target in your peripheral vision. Yep. So your, your target line is still kind of a point of this, but you're now gauging a bit of distance. All right, so off you go. Don't, you can, don't need your fingers and your plumb bobbing just yet. All right, there you go. So now you've got a bit of speed coming into the putt, all right? And you can see when you get to a course for the first time in the morning, if the greens from this distance are starting to be really quick or really slow, you do get a gauge from five or six feet. But you're also calm, you hold more putts than you miss because it's a short distance. Confidence is up and your alignment's up. So that's, that's the first stage on the putting green. Yep. And now we're down to the final thing, right? Probably knock the next one in, you're good at this. Look at you go, all right? So you can't, you can't. We've still got some minutes to go before you tee off. Get your own balls out. That's it. And now we're down to the third thing. So I'll tell you what you're gonna do. You're gonna come around here, all right? You're gonna drop your balls down. Okay. All three, right? And here's the goal of this. And I've watched people stuff this up over the years. Don't worry about a hole. Yep. I want you to hit your first putt, right, level with one of the holes down there, but don't hit it at the hole. So just hit it okay. level. Go. Give it your best shot. Okay. You haven't had a putt from distance, so who knows what this is going to do. Now watch it. Really watch it. Watch it roll out for the last half. Keep watching, keep watching. Don't take your eyes off it. In your mind, did it roll out a lot, a, a medium amount, or none? Oh, a medium amount. Right. <laughs> So you've, it rolled out somewhat. Right, so you've already started to gauge that the greens aren't ridiculously quick, but they're not slow, right? So you've got a middle range. Now hold on, oh. the next one has to go past that one. Okay. But only just, right? So right. try to get it going past it by about a foot to two feet. Good job. All right, well done. Running out, running out. Oh, this is great, Phil Burr. Oh, 
Would you like to measure that? I was going to measure. say. Measure. Oh, you're ready to tee off. <laughs> I'm going to give you, now the last part, this is yeah, what, what um, a tour players do. They putt up and down a green just like this. They only have a few putts. Yep. Testing green speed from this distance. You're already yep. finding your range. You've only had yep. two putts. Yep. Have your last one. Do. do it and we're ready to tee off. Come on. I might just finish this one between those two. <laughs> Look at the confidence levels go. I'd like to see your stress meter on your watch now. <laughs> it's gone right now. <laughs> Look at this. Fantastic. And you're ready. And I bet you still got, what's the time? We haven't even called our names. Come on, let's go play some ball. But you are ready, my friend. You're stretched. Shooter's, shooter's still not here. <laughs>